random vlog. This time it happens to be about uh, Sasquatch hunters. I, I enjoy the idea of Sasquatch. I do think that uh, it does exist. They are real. They have been seen. And like the UFO hysteria that's been, you know, buried for the last 70 years is coming to light. The government knows a hell of a lot more about it than they're letting on. And like Sasquatch, they're poo-pooing it, trying to keep it from becoming mass hysteria, panic, people going out and hunting them and trying to kill them and all this other stuff. But in talking about, you know, vlogs, YouTube is covered with avalanches of Sasquatch this, Sasquatch that. I was I was kissed by Sasquatch. I chased Sasquatch. Sasquatch kicked me in the ass one night, uh, you know, pissed on my fire while I was sleeping. All of these, you know, videos. Hundreds, hundreds, perhaps even tens of thousands of videos. Just, you know, type in Sasquatch and YouTube will just inundate you with them. Well, here you go. You know, you have these guys called Sasquatch Hunters and uh, they've got a Discovery Channel, History Channel, all kinds of, you know, uh, cable network pseudo news type things that uh, document their they're running around and people like this are just full of shit but there are legitimate people out there that have seen something they call it sasquatch and i don't doubt it uh there's a guy named uh tim lake lives in uh by god west virginia and he's a iraq veteran an Afghanistan veteran, um, went, uh, left the military, went to the Philippines, found a Filipina, married her, and uh, they both have vlogs. And his is mostly promoting his books. And I guess he's got maybe 500 titles out that are all Sasquatch related, you know, hunting Sasquatch, finding Sasquatch, Sasquatch kick me in the ass, all those types of titles. And he's doing very, very well, both with his vlog and his uh, books he sells on Amazon. Tim Lake, by the way, you can look him up. He's an all right guy, but uh, he's long-winded. Most of his videos are at least 30 minutes, if not longer. And uh, his... His lovely wife, uh, I'm trying to remember what her name is, but uh, she's got a vlog and mostly it's about cooking, Philippine recipes and that kind of thing. She has a garden, they have a garden, and they have a little boy. And uh, his videos are mostly him doing... Uh, chapters from his book like he'll sit on his back 40 and every once in a while he'll freak out because he hears something in the woods behind him and he squares by god as a sasquatch and there's a family of them and all this other stuff but it's entertaining you know he, he talks at you and shares with you and relates with you They're very good videos but there are those people out there that are doing these videos that are just absolutely stupid. When you when you go to hunt something, you know, like if you're going turkey hunting, you might take a little call with you, you know, all that stuff. Or duck hunting, you might have a duck call or whatever the case might be. But something that is nine feet friggin' tall, 500 plus pounds that has been known to eat animals raw yeah, you don't you don't want to put a mating call out for something like that. That is just stupid. And the the wrapping on the tree, you know, you, you hit a tree three times with a baseball bat, 
What do you suppose Sasquatch is thinking? When they do it, they're telling each other that there are idiots in the woods and uh, lay low. You know, don't, don't come out and play because these idiots are looking for us. What do you suppose they think when you do that? Is it a challenge? I think you're either flirting with disaster or you're too stupid to be in the woods at night, in the day, anytime. Stay out of the woods. Don't be stupid. Well, anyway, you know, it's funny at times to watch these shows because you have to laugh at the ignorance of these people who are filling their audiences full of crap you know they're pretending to be dramatic you know they're overacting you know bob and his buddy bill and their you know their long hair greasy black hair with their baseball caps and you know funky jeans hanging out in the woods doing their who 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 whatever you know they they deserve to get butt raped that would that would be a, a, a hilarious episode to watch. Bubba gets boned. Anyway, uh, that's another one of my pet peeves about videos, vloggers, TV programs that are supposedly supposed, you know, pushing, you know, enlightenment and education. But the reality of it is these people are just plain stupid and they're feeding Stupid people, stupid stuff. I do believe that Sasquatch is real. I think there are whole families of them out there. There could be whole clans of them out there. Um, but generally, they're not doing you any harm. You know, treat them with a little bit res of respect. You know, consider them to be like the uh, native gorillas of Africa. Just leave them alone and let them do their thing. You know, they're, they're not harming you. And uh, if you ever run into one, don't try to shake hands. Just enjoy the fact that you've seen one and leave it alone. That's my two cents worth on Sasquatch.